the Amlin 1963 chase from Ascot will close day one. It's a great two over two more three furlongs with lots of odd distances today. Cat irons at the top for Leon van Rensburg. Drum Lagen, Martin Liam, Kingdom Come, Daniel French. Stitching time for Graham Clutterbuck, Lady Bolt, David Hooley and the blank. Josh Russell and a field of six to close the day. And away we go. Heading towards the first. I think that's the smallest field we've had so far today. Well, so far, this is the last race. They get to the first. Which they're all over safely. The smallest field we've had is five, so it's not too bad. No, two runner or three runner races so far this week as they get over the second. And these fences come pretty thick and fast on the, this part of the track. And that's good. And they all successfully negotiate the first three of them without mishap. And Stitching Time is in the lead. And I suppose all those people who like to think of me as being a waffling moana will turn around to me and say, well, you want things to be realistic, mate. You're all the ones going on about realistic. And National Hunt Racing, realistically, three, four, five, six runner runners, six runner races is what you get. And that is what we're getting. So, yeah, that told me. <laughs> I say get over that one. And there's a forward about Cat Iron. The one at the top, um, number one, the top horse, Leon Van Rensburg, was, was not travelling well at all and was already somewhere adrift. And I think there was probably something amiss with that anyway, but he got rid of the jockey. So we're down to just five now in this one as they take the fifth. And we're almost down to four there as Drum Lagen was right down on his nose when it's stitching time. In the lead for Graham Clutterbuck. Lady Bolt is second. And Kingdom Come is third as they pass the winning post with a full circuit of the Ascot track to go. And stitching time. My two lengths. Lady Bolt second. Kingdom Come third. And the blank is fourth. And Drum Lagan is fifth. Stitching time over the sixth in front. Stitching time saved nine or something. I'm not sure where that comes from or what it is, but it just seems to ring a bell to me for some reason. Lady Bolt is in the second as they get over the seventh. Good jump on the outside there by Drum Lagen, who made that mistake earlier. He's now jumped his way through into second place. The blank is back in fourth as they get to this ditch. Oh, the leader's gone. He made a really bad mistake and the jockey couldn't hang on and a stitch in time. He couldn't save nine or even himself then as he exited the side door. They get over the ninth and suddenly there's only four left in it and the blank is in the lead. Ron Drum Lager in second. Kingdom Come is on the inside of that one in third. With the back marker now of the four lady bolt. Wide open race, the loose horses potentially getting in the way of the blank at the moment. And Kingdom Come might push them wide and allow Lady Bolt to slip up the inside as they get to the 10th. And over that one they go. And the blank looks like he's got past the loose horse now as they come into this next one. The blank lands in the lead. Kingdom Come is over its second. Drum Lagen third, Lady Bolt four. This is the final ditch. That's the fourth for home. And the blank. Kingdom come and it looks like the others are going to switch around the outside rather than potentially try and negotiate that loose horse but it's the blank who's in front from Kingdom come and drum log and Lady Bot just struggling a little bit at the back as they begin the turn into home they've got a couple to take and it's the blank in the lead. Josh Russellland's already had three winners, I think, this week. Looking to make it another one with Kingdom coming second. Drum Lagan is back in third. Lady Bolt trying to run on in fourth. The blanks over the second last in the lead and clear of Kingdom Come and Drum Lagan and then Lady Bolt. And I don't think they're going to get to this leader. If he jumps the last, he should win and end the day the way he started it for Josh Russellland. It's going to be the blank who's going to give him a leader about a dozen. I think in the championship if he stands under this one but Kingdom Come's got something to say about it and he's beginning to close the Blank is holding on Kingdom Come now he's trying to get closer the Blank is going to need the line to come Kingdom Come is beginning to lunge they race up towards the line it's the Blank Kingdom Come's getting closer the Blank wants the line he's Kingdom Come on the near side Kingdom Come that Blank holds on Kingdom Come second Lady Bolt third Drum Lagen back in fourth and to work a lot harder for that one than most of the others today. 
Joshua Sutherland but he's well clear at the top and he wins another group race, group race only grade two today this one but the black is the winner for Joshua Sutherland Kingdom Come was second for Daniel French Lady Bolt David Healy third Drum Lagan was fourth and we'll be back tomorrow with more thrills and spills <laughs>